Hi guys, it's Kelly Clinton hyphen Holmes and it's Monday and uh, I'm getting a little antsy now because I'm so used to the fun and excitement we have on our open mic cabaret at the Bootlegger Bistro every Monday night for, oh my goodness, 19 years. So I thought how nice it is that everybody's sharing their talent, trying to lift the spirits and I thought my part should maybe be bringing back some of the old sketches that I have talked many friends into participating uh, with me on Monday nights. One of my best friends in the whole world, she's actually my very best friend and oldest friend uh, from high school, Lena Prima, always says yes. In fact, the sketch I'm gonna share with you tonight, she instigated this. So it's called the Kardashian Sisters. Why don't you go order some food from the bootlegger and pick it up and sit back and enjoy one of the archived sketches. Be safe and take care of yourselves. Please put your hands together for the lovely Kardashian sisters. <laughs> Together, we're the Kardashians. Can I get a microphone for my sister? Because I have to have this Thank one you. myself. Anyway, we are really famous for literally absolutely no reason whatsoever. So we love Las Vegas. Do you love Las Vegas? It though later. Yeah, fix it. But we love Las Vegas. I love Las Vegas. We've been here like a million times. Yeah. And like, um, we just, you know, we've never actually like ever literally been here to the bootlegger. Yeah, like where the hell even is this place? Like, is this even on the strip? I don't know. I really don't know. It's really far down the strip. But you know, I mean, when our friend, who's such a great singer, asked us to be here, there was no way we were going to say no to Kelly Clarkson. That's right. Kelly Clinton. What? Kelly Clinton. Who is she? I have no idea. We don't even know her. Is she even famous? I've I don't literally think so. never ever heard of her. Well, anyway, we're here now, and you know. I'm, I'm having a good time already. Um, I mean, I haven't been to Las Vegas in a really long time. The last time I was here, I was like at the MGM Grammar Grand Arena, and I was seeing that very funny comedian, our really good friend, Dave Chappelle. What? You were supposed to call me, like, you were supposed to literally call me. It was like the funniest show like I've ever, ever seen. If you guys could. Stop describing it when you didn't call me. It was, I'm going to punch you right in the face. It was like Eddie Murphy was sitting like right next to me. Literally like right next to me. And then all of a sudden John Mayer came out. And he was like playing music while they were telling their very funny jokes. What is that? I am literally picking up all the names you just dropped. Uh, well, and then Paul McCartney came in. Who's Paul McCartney? Are you serious? You don't know who Paul McCartney no. is? Are you kidding, Chloe? Oh my god, he's like one of the original monkeys. Oh. You've got to get out in the world now. Anyway, so let's talk about you. Like, my sister Chloe, isn't she beautiful? She's got a new show, and she does, like, makeovers for people. I do. Yeah. In fact, I did your makeover, I think. You look really beautiful. beautiful. Really beautiful. Yeah. But you know what else is Chloe just had her first baby. Oh, my God, Kim. I did not have the baby yet. Oh. I guess that was Courtney or Kylie or Kendall. Yeah. Well, um, anyway. So stupid. Well, at least we know that she's, um, the father of the baby is like a really famous basketball player. Tell him what his name is. Okay, so I literally don't know right now. I, I just, I, I don't know. 
Do you mean you don't know his name? No, I don't know exactly who that is right now, literally. Oh my god, so are you saying that someone else could be the father? Well, like who else could be the father? Well, right, it could literally be anyone on the Cavaliers. <laughs> well, whatever, you know, we love you no matter what. I love you too. Please. As you guys know, we have a television show, and it's like everything in our life is like on the screen and everything, and we've been through a lot of different things, right? Yes, a lot of changes our family yeah. has been through. But no matter how many changes and whatever happens, we'll always be together. I love my sister. I love my sister. Sisters, sisters, both of us are such devoted sisters. Mom was always like a chaperone, yes sir. Bruce always kept his eye on her. He was caring, he was sharing every little thing that mom was wearing. On a certain evening, he was left alone. He had on her dress when she came home. It was black leather, his stuff stuck together. Three things had turned into one. Both of his faces tied in the right places. She thinks to act as one. <laughs> Those hoops, we've seen us. No, our daddy just cut off his penis. <laughs> Did he like literally like for real like take it off completely? Is it gone? Oh, I, I don't even want to talk about that right now. Like I can't even, I don't even want to go there right now. Like I don't know. Well, it's like I tried to look and like I couldn't really see anything there. It was like, oh my God, Kim. it was like, what do you call that thing where it's like, oh, it's, it's like an animal that's in the desert. It's a camel toe. Oh my God. <laughs> Lord help the mister Who suddenly looks like our sister And Lord help my sister Who wishes he still was a man Except, you know, Bruce as Caitlin now. I mean, it's like where he wants to be and who he wants to be, and we can't really judge him. I, I can't accept that. He is a man, too. He is a dude. Well, I mean, right now he doesn't feel like one, and he's got to be happy. And that's the most important thing. Don't you think that people should just be who they are and be happy? Just go with me on this, or this bit will go on forever. <laughs> You've got to be kinder. I just think it's important, and, and I do, I think, I do, I think it's very important. If you are so smart, you would totally know that that word is literally not pronounced that way. That way. What? Way? What? It is important. Important. Whatever. Sisters. Sisters. Both of us are such devoted sisters. I think that if you really have the kindness in your heart, that we should even ask her to come out here. You mean him? No, I mean her. Him. She. He is a dude, dude. He won Olympic gold medals. Yeah, but I mean, women and men win uh, Olympic gold medals. It was in the men's category, Kim. Whatever. Caitlin! Bruce! Mom! Dad! Come on out here, whoever you are. Just And that is my gold purse. Well, I gotta tell you, mister, you, 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 make the pretty
Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, that's Kurt Kardashian.